What's up guys, it's the Hunter Project here. Welcome to another Valheim video. Be sure to smash the like subscribe buttons if you do enjoy or find anything here interesting as it would be extremely appreciated as we make our way to 1000 subscribers. And without wasting any more time, let's just get right into this video. So this video will be on a mod called Forever Build. And this will allow you to become the ultimate builder by making every structure that you place have a very firm support. So you'll never have to worry about that building that has that pesky roof to fit in that's maybe too high, highly placed or even a tower that's just too tall to the point where it just lost all its stability right at the top. And of course you can prevent, prevent this by of course uh, this mod which will allow all the building structures to have a very firm support when placed. Of course, this mod is quite game breaking in comparison to vanilla Valheim, but if your goal in Valheim is to build magnificent castles and towers without worrying about it being fully supported, then this mod is for you. You'll still obviously have the ability to make sure everything is looking aesthetically realistic by of course having the uh, given supports built in but these won't have to technically have enough stability to hold up a construct as it won't have any effect on them but you can still make the support look as though it's holding it up but for the most part this is basically just directly aimed at people who specifically want to focus on building for maybe even like video creation or just their own like uh, free time just to relax and just build buildings and structures without having to worry about all the problem solving of where they should be placing specific supports to make sure they have optimum stability in their roofs and just overall structure. The installation process for this mod is quite simple and straightforward. So when installing it for yourself you have to make sure that first you have the framework mod Bepin EX. So you can download this mod from the link in the description along with the other mod required from Nexus mods and of course that the Nexus mod mod being the the forever build and you'll need to um, basically move the contents of the Vepin folder into the Steam Valheim folder so it looks like this now and you can see the route that I took to get to the folder at the top and all you just need to do is go into the drive that Steam is located on, go into Steam apps common and then finally Valheim and by the way if you guys do have any issues with installing the mod just be sure to drop a comment down below and I'll help you out as soon as I can and of course someone else might help you out if they already know and come across your comment and after placing the files like inside the Valheim folder simply just launch the game and it should install any additional files with the console popping up to identify that the mod is running and now that the framework is installed and of course if you already have it installed then you don't have to do anything about this area of the video simply just download the forever build mod and place the .dll file which is in the download folder of the forever build uh, download file and just place that into the plugins folder that is located in the bepin ex folder and you can see a screenshot on screen what it should look like as well as the route at the top that i took and yeah, that's it. You are done. You should be ready to go and build to your heart's content. This does bring us to the end of the video, guys. If you did enjoy, be sure to smash the like subscribe buttons. It is extremely, extremely appreciated as we make our way to 1000 subscribers, which I am optimistically aiming to hit by the end of March, if not March, sometime in the middle of April. And let me know down below if you want to see any more Valheim videos, specifically any other mod videos, as I do love checking out different mods that change the way the game's played from the vanilla version. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.